up you guys welcome back to yet another review today we're going to be taking a look at another mini racer 3 pack this is probably my favorite mini racer 3 pack of 2023 because it includes three mini racers that i don't have and are probably the coolest mini racers for cars on the road so yeah we're going to be taking a look at the road rumblers mini racer 3 pack that includes rumbler mcqueen rumbler mater and the the chiefess herself and i brought out um rumbler mcqueen as a color changer over here in comparison for the mcqueen and then these two i don't really have I know that Rumbler Made It will be released as a die cast. Chief just maybe, but it's not really confirmed yet. So yeah, let's go over the packaging and then get to the review of this. So yeah, you got uh, Mater and Cars on the Road McQueen art there. You got the Mini Races logo up there. These are the Cars on the Road with the map in the back there with all the landmarks and stuff, locations. You got the warrant of the choking hazard there. Metal, Mattel, they just threw it up there. And on the back, you got the um, three musketeers themselves with the stock images. Rumbler McQueen, Chiefess, and Rumbler Mater. It's funny how these two have the most translations where Chiefess only has like five or six or whatever. Or seven. Yeah, seven. All right, anyway, let's get this all opened up and out of the package. All right, here we have all the three mini racers out of the package. They look stunning and beautiful. So yeah, I guess we'll just get into the review of them, shall we? Yeah, um, I'm gonna start with Rumbler Mater and then go on to these two later. So yeah, let's start with Rumbler Mater here. So yeah, uh, I don't have any ru other Rumbler Maters compared to, but I mean, he is pretty cool. I mean, he's got all these spikes here, which are actually textured, which is really cool. And they're gray, which is really nice. He has a really cool expression with his mouth closed for some reason, but I mean, wouldn't you be like yelling? Wouldn't his mouth be like open if he's like, like, yeah, like in the Road Rumbler? Um, party. Not really party, but whatever. You got this horn on the su on him, which is pretty cool looking. And you also got this uh, plastic flamethrower up top here, which is also kind of flexible. But if you don't want to break your flamethrower, then I would not. I would suggest not doing that. He does have some like rusted dirt or whatever on his uh, on his wheels there, which looks pretty good in my opinion. Very very nice added detail with all the spikes, and even the spikes continue onto the back. And then you also have uh, the uh, the spiky ball on the back of him, which is really cool looking. Although it is like stuck into the thing, which you can't like swing it around or anything. But yeah, it is a mini racer. Can't complain. Where's the date stamp? Uh, that's right here. Uh, SOA made in the eighth week of 2023 in the A factory. Well, there's no A, but whatever. Yeah, that is the date stamp. I mean, Thailand, obviously. All right, let's move on to the queen herself chief Dis. now this is probably my favorite mini racer of the of the year so far just because she has a lot of detail that we'll go over all right so she does have a really cool evil looking expression i mean she is the queen of the road rumbler so yeah she got a she has a flexible crown up here but which i don't really want to break it so i'm just gonna stop doing that and she also has this really nice looking like metallic um color which is really cool you also got the little spikes on the side here that go from big to small there. And then you also got a dirty bumper, which is cool. On the side, you got some weird little tire marks, which is really cool, and some rust and stuff like that. Pretty cool. And on the back, you have some, like, dents or whatever, or spikes maybe. And you also got those tire marks continuing on this side. There's the other side. Oh, yeah, there is some, like, dirt detailing down there. Or rust detailing or whatever. Shiny bumper, but kind of dirty bumper too. Anyway, you got the date stamp, which reads SO8A, May, uh, SO8, May the 8th week of 2022. No, yeah, 2023. Yeah. All right, now let's move on to the uh, new mini racer here, Rumbler Lightning McQueen. I don't know why they, they like, chose to make him, like, so long, like, before... Rumbler Mater and Chief Dis. I mean, after Rumbler Mater and Chief Dis, but whatever. This is pretty cool. Alright, let's compare him to the Color Changer, which I do not have the regular diecast yet, so. Yeah, but whatever. I will review it and compare it to this one and this one. So, yeah. The expressions are obviously different. This one has, like, a more worry, but, like, happy. I'm not really sure. Like, an in the middle of worried and happy expression. I feel like you should have an angry expression like this one, but this one works. Um, you do have the, uh, intake up here, which is colored and has the logo underneath it. Over here, you just have 
a non-colored intake with no um, on the road. I mean, it's understandable because this is a color changer. So yeah. And also you do have some dirt around his mouth there. Yeah. On the side here, you have the like spiky things. Oh wait, I forgot about the shovel beard, of course. You also have like little spiky um, fenders there. And then you also got the boarded side, which this one has the spiky fenders, but the boarded side is not colored, which is annoying. But yeah, they did uh, go out of their way to add extra detail on the 95 there, which is really cool. On the back, you obviously have the colored in spoiler and the the this little thing i'm not really sure what it's called but the spoiler and this little bumper are not colored on the color changer but they are here so yeah and also some dirt there's the other side oh it's color changing Ooh. and you also got like the little um we even call it uh i literally forgot the name i'm just thinking, thinking of like mohawk yeah mohawk obviously <laughs> You have to have the mohawk there, which is, yeah, it looks good. But the main thing is, uh, the main thing, uh, it look, it look kind, it honestly kind of looks like that McQueen has brown, um, gear, but over here it just has black gear, or grayish gear, or whatever. And you also got these little uh, exhaust pipes. I'm just blanking out on everything. Anyway, SOA Dave, mainly A3 get 2023. So yeah, that's about it for the review of the Rumbler 3-pack, and I gotta say, yes, it did live up to the hype that I anticipated, and oh my gosh, I'm moving the camera around. But whatever, this pack is amazing, 10 out of 10 pack, includes three mini races that I do not yet have, but now have, because like, Mattel is nice, and these three mini races are just super cool. But yeah, I'll see you guys later for the next review tomorrow of the B-Movie 3-pack.